converting squared and cubed units. If we would like to convert something as 8 square yards equals how many square feet, we can't just look at a conversion table like we did when our units were not squared. We can't just look up here and say 1 yard equals 3 feet and use that information. It doesn't work that way. However, we are going to use that to help us. The fact we know about yards and feet is one yard is equal to three feet. And if we square both of those, one yard squared means one yard times one yard. One times one is one. Yard times yard is squared yards. Equals. Well, this means three feet times three feet. 3 times 3 is 9, and feet times feet is feet squared. Now we have a fact that we can use to convert. So take your fact, and we're going to use proportions to solve. So 1 square yard equals 9 square feet. Set it equal, we have 8 yards squared. Since there's an equal sign here, we're going to line up the units of measure. So the 8 yards squared is going to go in the numerator x in the denominator, because we don't know how many square feet. Solve the proportion. 1 times x is x, and 8 times 9 is 72. So it's going to be 72 square feet. Same is true if you're doing cubed units. So again, we need to think about the fact we know about inches and feet. There's 12 inches in one foot. Cube both sides. So this means 12 inches times 12 inches times 12 inches. So 1,728 inches cubed equals, and this is 1 foot times 1 foot times 1 foot, which is 1 foot cubed. Here is our fact. So we're going to set up a proportion. 1,728 inches cubed equals one foot cubed, or not equals, I'm sorry, 1,728 inches cubed over one foot cubed equals, so we have nine feet cubed. We're going to line up the units, so nine feet cubed is going to go in the denominator, x in the numerator, cross multiply, one times x is x, and nine times 1,728 is 15,000. 552, and that would be inches cubed.